ghost ships and their unexplained appearances. Legend or reality? Today we will learn the story of the most famous ghost ship in the world, the fearsome Flying Dutchman and his captain, Van der Tekken. Today in Boo Beam, I'll tell you everything next. Let's start by defining what a ghost ship is. A ghost ship is a real ship that has been sighted, has an apparition after sinking, or a ship found floating with or without a crew on board. In the simple definition, the story involves a ship that people say is hunted or cursed. Just over 500 years ago, there was a devoted man of the sea named Baron Folk. He was a 17th century Frisian-born captain of the Dutch East Indian Company. But all the data indicates that the captain was called according to the German sailors with the codename Van der Tekem. Van der Tekem was known for the amazing speed of his travels, from the Dutch Republic to the Java. The sailors who traveled with Van der Tekem respected and feared him at the same time, but they liked it sailing with him because he was fair in the sharing of profits and treasure. Besides, he liked it to take them to the brothels of the Caribbean. They say that the devil had given the Dutch captain Binder Tekken the power to make his ships the fastest ship on all the sea. After the man sold his soul to him one night with a full moon. The legend begins at the Cape of Good Hope, which is located at the southern tip of Africa, specifically on the Atlantic coast of Cape Peninsula in South Africa. The discoverer of this point of the earth was the Portuguese Bartolomeu Dias in the year 1487 and the one who baptized with the original name of Cave of the Storms and that later King John II of Portugal changed the name to Cave of Boa Esperança or Cape of the New Hope, name for the hope, optimism and joy that inspires the opening of a possible sea route to India and the East. Bartolomeu Diaz Parish on Cape of Good Hope of a Storm. But how does the story of the Flying Dutchman come about? Legend has it that the Flying Dutchman, a galleon with several mass and white sails, loaded letters, spices and other products in the Indies and prepared to return to Amsterdam. But at the Cape of Good Hope, they sighed a storm in the distance. The crew asked the captain to seek refuge in the nearest port, but he refused, shoots an officer, and throw him overboard. The captain mocks his sailors and declares that he fears nothing and no one. The storm worsen and the captain challenges God to sink his ship. At that moment, a luminous figure appears on the deck. Everyone on the ship trembles in terror, while the captain pulls out a gun and shoots at him, shouting. Who wants a smooth ride? I do not. I am not asking you for anything. Get lost or I will blow your brains out. Suddenly, the celestial figure confronts the captain, saying, You who put your ambition to the suffering of all us. From now on, you will be content to travel to the ocean. Between storms, you will only keep one cabin boy, and since you lie to torment your navigators, I will turn you into the evil spirit of the sea. Pray 
The celestial figure disappeared, taking with it the entire crew, and that is how Captain Binder Tekem and the Galean now has the flying Dutchman were turned into a ghost and condemned to wander aimlessly, even though the sea is calm until the end of time. The flying Dutchman, according to German sailors, managed to spot him when the captain and his crew manifested themselves in the form of three old men with long beards and when trying to approach them they disappear. French sailors also claim to have seen it, indicating that the Flying Dutchman does to visit passing ships and sends letters that drives the captain who reads them crazy. They explain that the captain has the power to lift ships and change his appearance during the curse. It is time to take a little break. I want to tell you you can subscribe to my channel completely free. The only thing that you have to do is press subscribe, thumbs up and press the bell. And if you are already subscribed, welcome to our channel. There are many sailors who say they have come across this terrifying galleon, and others have perished in the face of such terrible present, but whatever the supernatural has a place there, science tries to deny it, but analyzing the situation, science indicates that did sightings have a logic, the phenomenon in question is called Fata Morgana, and it occurs when light refractions causes it to bend in a different air temperature it is something similar to what happens when we look at the horizons on a highway when it's hot. Surely we begin to see hot waves that move or lines on the ground. In the case of the boat, they are actually below the horizon, but the light bends over the water in a way that allows them to be seen as floating or even fold into two images. Has the sign found the truth about the Flying Dutchman? Curious fact. Did you know that the Flying Dutchman is equipped with 64 one-ton cannons? The Flying Dutchman has a 52 meter high mast. It is estimated to be 79 meters long and 60 meters high from the keel to the main mast. The story of the Flying Dutchman is one of the most famous in the world, and it has been adapted in numerous feature films, cartoons such as The Simpsons and SpongeBob, as well as in Hollywood movies. Disney been the most famous in adapting the story of the Flying Dutchman in his famous Pirates of the Caribbean franchise, where the Flying Dutchman has a different captain named Davy Jones, but I think just as terrifying as Van Der Tekken. I want you to comment on the best adaptation of the Flying Dutchman that you like. Please leave me your comments. Pirate legends have always been characterized by having some truth, and as science wants to deny this great legend at all costs, he has not yet found the location of the Flying Dutchman. If you dare and want to see the Flying Dutchman, you should go to South Africa, specifically in the Cape of Good Hope. Maybe you will be able to see it on the horizon, but for nothing in the world sail in those waters, because the Flying Dutchman is always attentive in the search of his next soul. Without a doubt, the Flying Dutchman is a fantastic tale. Don't forget to press like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Boom B says goodbye.